vetiver are sort of meant to be for men. But they're a bit like my watch. My big watch is worn a lot by women. Or a shirt like mine are a lot, is a lot it was worn by women. It doesn't mean that something made for a man cannot be used by a woman. Vice versa, it's sort of funny. It's funny, yeah. Flowers are rarely worn by men, except if they are very transgressive. And sometimes, I mean, I've met men wearing carnal flower, and it's surprisingly good. Something like Portrait of a Lady, which for me is the ultimate feminine fragrance, is very oriental. And on some men it works. I see men today with a lot of jewelry. You have men with bracelets one after the other now. It is jewelry for men. Ten years ago, no man was wearing jewelry, otherwise it would have been odd. Even homosexuals did not wear jewelry. Today, men of all kinds, straight, gays, everybody is wearing jewelry. It's a cool thing. And, and they wear this maybe more feminine fragrances because there's much more freedom. Today we live in a world where people sort of assume their choices very much and want to be specific. So even if it's something is thought for a woman, it doesn't mean that a man cannot use them. Monsieur is very, very seductive without being macho, but supremely elegant. So it's for this very manly man. Um, classic but with this sort of twist and it has this sort of suave and debonair look to it. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. We'll see you again.